Washington. You were in China trying to resolve the dispute with North Korea in a diplomatic way. President Trump tweeted, I told Rex Tillerson, our wonderful Secretary of State, that he is wasting his time trying to negotiate with Little Rocket Man. And then he sent a second tweet saying, save your energy, Rex. We'll do what has to be done. Now, if I were a Chinese official or a North Korean official, seeing these tweets while you were there trying to negotiate and try to solve this problem, I might think Secretary Tillerson doesn't really speak for President Trump. Well, fortunately, uh, Jake, President uh, Trump and President Xi have probably one of the closest relationships the president has with the head of state. As you're aware, they've had two uh, major face-to-face -face meetings, the summit in Mar-a-Lago, uh, a very comprehensive bilateral in uh, Hamburg. The president speaks to President Xi on the telephone frequently. I think they've had eight, seven or eight calls. Uh, I have a very close relationship with the state counselor of China who reports directly to President Xi on their foreign policy. Uh, so rest assured that the Chinese are not confused in any way what the American uh, policy towards North Korea or what our actions in it and efforts are directed at. Uh, so but don't tweets like that undermine you? Well, I think the pres what the president's doing is he's trying to motivate action uh, on a number of people's part, in particular the regime in North Korea. I think he does want to be clear with Kim Jong-un and that regime in North Korea that he has military preparations ready to go, and he has those military options on the table, and we have spent substantial time actually perfecting those. But, but be clear, the president has also made clear to me that he wants this solved diplomatically. He is not seeking uh, to go to war. So he but, doesn't think it's a waste of time? But I, No, sir. He has uh, made it clear to me to continue my diplomatic efforts, uh, which we are, and we will, con as I've told others, those diplomatic efforts will continue until the first bomb drops.